Good dog, Lily. In case you can't tell, I'm a dog. There are so many things I love about being a dog. Like going to the dog park, going to work with mom and dad, and doing sit or stay for treats. Good morning, Gophers. Today is Tuesday, December 1st, 2020. I'm Caitlin. And I'm Chloe. And this is the Gopher News Show. We have exciting news. The Scholastic Virtual Book Fair has begun. Tell your parents, family, and friends it's a great time to start holiday shopping. Today's lunch choices include peanut butter and jelly sandwich, French market combo, and game day nachos. Wednesday, December 2nd, lunch choices include peanut butter and jelly sandwich, smoothie combo, hamburger, or cheeseburger. Here is Janessa with Nash National Christmas Lights Day. National Christmas Lights Day. Time to deck the halls, folks, because December 1st is National Christmas Lights Day. Before the invention of electric lights, families would balance candles on the branches of their Christmas trees, a risky practice that naturally led to several house fires. Electric Christmas lights were first invented in 1880 by Thomas Edison, who promptly strung them all over the outside of his Menlo Park Laboratory because people were initially distrustful of electricity. However, it took another several decades for the invention to catch on. And it wasn't until 1903 when General Electric became began selling pre-assembled kits of Christmas lights. The electric lights became popular with people of all classes. Today, light electric lights are integral part of the winter holiday season and certainly are exclusive to Christmas. As we get ready for the end of the year, let's drain up our lights and celebrate. Tis the season after all. Thank you, Janessa and me. Here's Caitlin with the weather reminders and the birthdays. It's cold. Students, please remember to bring your jackets when you are leaving your room, especially in the afternoon when you go home. Happy birthday to Colton H. in third grade, Addison N. in fifth grade, and Amara S. in fourth grade. Remember to be safe, responsible, brave, and respectful. Thank you for tuning to the Governor Show. Have a great Gopher Day!